doing? Cleaning up this damn room. There's like a tornado hitting. This, I want to get rid of that. I want to get rid of that and that and that. Four things <laughs> that I'm going to have to do Which when one? Jake is sleeping. That yeah, that's what I'm saying. I want to get rid of this one. I want to get rid of this. I want to get rid of that. That he plays with, though. With that he, nah, I'm going to get rid of that. You don't want that. You said he plays with that? Yeah, he messes with that. Don't get rid of that. Don't get rid of that? All right, yeah, so then nice that one. Little... That one needs to go. That one needs to go. This needs to go. You need to go. <laughs> <laughs> you hear that? Uh, uh, uh. I don't know. He needs a big toy chest. Yeah, get the big choices. Even though half of this shit is salves, practically, from when she was a kid. We have two boxes in the attic filled, I mean, filled with toys from Sav when she was little. I'm about to just take the whole box and just get rid of the whole thing. Yeah. Yeah, because she don't play with that stuff anymore. They're all Barbies and this, that, and the other. I mean, you gotta shower. <laughs> Why don't you go to the bathroom? You ready to shower right this minute? You told me to get showered! You need a towel and stuff? Don't be a white hat. She wants to get snuffed. Oh! Dummy, what are you hitting she me? She did! So stupid. Gotta get fan. Oh. Ah! Ah! Achoo! <laughs> <laughs> make, oh, make your farting noises and stuff. No, I'm not. I was going to the bathroom, you dumb freak. That doesn't help your face. <laughs> Don't we call my closet? Because it's a hot mess in here. Monsters will come out at you if you come in here. <laughs> That's Jake going up the stairs. Come up, come up. Don't just stay out there. It's a lot of work. <laughs> Come on, you fuck. <laughs> Get up out. You gotta work. curse me out. Why you gotta be all up in my face? I know you love me. I don't. I know you think I'm so Oh, please. Your friends are trying to freeload on my tickets. Nobody's trying to freeload. First of all, don't go there because you're the one inviting people, okay? Nobody freeloading, nobody asked you. You asked me to ask them. So that's not freeloading. I'm cutting this. <laughs> <laughs> First of all, I'm not even paying attention to what you're saying right now because I'm busy thinking of something else. So I want to uh, counter attack you with your problems right now. I'm just, just totally spaced out thinking about something Cause else. Because you're a fucking airhead. Because I have a lot of things to do. A busy guy. Yeah. Yeah? No! Turn it up. You wanna go outside? Clothes on. You wanna take Karen? 
So we heading into Brooklyn to drop off my daughter's friend. Get rid of her little ass. <laughs> Wait, did you get rid of her ass? Big breasts, like I said. If I want a girl with big breasts, I just get a young girl. Uh, I mean, 
I just get a girl with big breasts. You know what I mean? Uh, I, why would I invest uh, 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 five, six thousand dollars for you to get breast implants when I could just get uh, a girl that already got breasts and shit? Well, that's the point. The point is that first of all, by you getting hair plugs, it's for yourself, okay? Because I know you'll be ready. Just get a girl that don't give a. I got a light bulb, guys. That's it. That's all. I got a light bulb. That you'll be saying, "Oh damn, I'm going more. I'm going more. I'm going more." This, that, and the other. Because you don't like it yourself. I don't. Of course, I don't. But you know what I mean. So it's not just about oh doing it for a girl or for me or whatever. You just because I say, "Oh, I'm going more," doesn't mean that I'm saying. Doesn't mean that I'm that I'm saying that I'm saying, oh I'ma go get hair, but I ain't. It's not happening. You know what I mean? I'm gonna go do what I this, that, and the other. But well, there's no doing it. Fuck that. It's like me saying, oh well, you know, um, you know, your breast is sagging and shit. Why don't you just get some breast implants? Oh, I get breast implants. Get them now, now, not twenty years from now. Twenty years from now, today. Oh, you know what I mean? Because it ain't gonna take me ten years to get them. Twenty years from now, today. Get them now, now, not twenty years from now, today. Because it ain't gonna ten years that too late. I could just have gone, gone out there and got me a young girl with big breasts. You know what I mean? You know what I'm talking about? Fuck out of here. Why I spend uh, six thousand dollars on a breast? Why I'm gonna invest that on to enhance your breast when I can just get it for free from someone else that I can just meet? Don't okay. make any damn sense. Damn, I'm mad smart, man. No, you're mad smart. Shit. You do have to spend money because you think you just ain't gonna get no girls to give you their breasts for free. Shit, do I look like I'm going bold? Hell yeah, right? <laughs> Fuck, I don't give a fuck, you Dinner, know what I mean? I gotta do what I gotta do, you know? So just shut up. All that's coming out of your mouth is pure shit. Garbage. Your fucking mouth is like sanitation. <laughs> <laughs> Full of garbage. <laughs> shit, if my balls start sagging real low, what are you gonna say? Oh, 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 uh, get something to cuff them up and shit, pick them up or something? <laughs> <laughs> if they hanging out from the sides of your shorts, <laughs> just let the motherfuckers hang. Oh, close the window. Oh, you're back. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> right now we're in Coney Island, Brooklyn. We're going to my old spot where I used to live at. I was raised there. I used to live there for like about twenty something years. I moved the fuck out of there though. <laughs> I was getting tired of the shots being fired. <laughs> so this is the building over here. How about showing them? <laughs> How about shutting the hell up? This is the building over here. I'm gonna try to get in the building without being shot four or five times. <laughs> Just kidding. Reason when I had got in the car, I didn't park my car right here. Would you park in there? Park a little further up. <laughs> Safe for me. <laughs> <laughs> We're preventing it from getting damaged. Like over here. I'm going in with you? Yeah, you're gonna hold the camera, goddammit. This is the old public school that I that I used to go to. I ended up getting transferred out, not because I was a bad boy, I guess. <laughs> I don't know, but I got transferred out to a better school, I think. <laughs> it wasn't called this, though, before. It was to change the name. Uh, so this is where I used to live at over here. I used to live in this building on the seventh floor. And we're going to go into the building and go up, go in the elevator and go up and go up to uh, the seventh floor, right to the door where I used to live at, where I was raised at. I lived there for over 20 years, probably like 21 years before I actually moved out. But this is the building right here, in Coney Island. And that's my girlfriend's building over there, and I used to hang out in that building behind the trees park over here one thing when you walk in when you're walking in the project you should well right now they got this construction area here 
uh, here, but when this is not here, when you, every time you're walking in project buildings, you should always look up because there's always a hater or somebody that don't like you and they will throw something and it can hit you in your head and kill you. I've seen people get hurt like that. I mean, things, ice, uh, buckets full of ice or uh, paint, or uh, half a bucket full of paint, it, it can seriously hit you. So every time you walk in, you should always look up in the, in the building, you know, to give it at least a quick second to move out the way. <laughs> I'm serious, I'm just serious. Every time I walk, I would look up in the building. If I go to the other building, which is that building right there, that's Ocean Towers right there. Especially that building. That building has, is notorious for people. That building right there is notorious for people throwing stuff from back then. I don't know about now. This is the building I used to live in. This spot right here, a lot of people, drug dealers used to hang out here, push cars out. This is the ticket right here. Before they had these windows out here, they were actually. Half the bottom of the person. It's one elevator. This one's working. You get stuck. Wait, wait, wait. Elevator. This elevator is working. This elevator is always on pause. Hey, on TV? YouTube. Oh, wow. You're representing you Brooklyn. You want to say something about the building? Yeah, disgusting. I used to live here. I used, I used I've been living here for 15 years. We had that boxing gym right here. They used to box. About. Yes, and they closed it down. For what reason? I don't know. This elevator right here. Mama, go touch the button. I used to live. I used to Sucks. Now I live in the eighth floor. And every time this elevator doesn't work, we have to use the step. And guess what? When I fix it, two days, it's already damaged. Yeah. They don't take care of it. Gotta walk up. And scary. why is the reason they put video camera in the hallway? They still can come in. <laughs> oh, I used to live in this building for over 20 some years. I was raised here, but I moved. Ended up moving I heard this building was way back. It was different. Yeah, it was different. Yeah. You know, we had security and all that good stuff. It was, yeah, it was still bad though. The rent is too high here, yeah, and then they expect true. you to live well. And the right. rent is too high. Right. They don't fix nothing here. So, all right, all right, guys. Bye, bye. Thanks a lot. I hope that I, I see you in YouTube. Living with the cousins. All right, there you go. Thank you. This is the floor. This is the seventh floor. Live here. Come on, Chris. He used to live okay. here. This is his door. It looks different. <laughs> this is the door. This is the door I used to live in right here. 704. This is 705. And I, uh, somebody else is still living there. I mean, a couple of people died. This is the door that I was raised. raised in, I don't know who lives here right now. I would I feel like knocking on the door. It's very nice. Four bedrooms, check it out. What's good with, about the project, I ain't even gonna lie. What's good about the projects is that uh, it was four bedrooms, two bathrooms, right? It was like a man, it's like a mansion. <laughs> uh, like, uh, well, let me show you how many One, uh, five closets around that range. Five closets. And you only paid $179 a month. That was back then. $179 a month, 
and you gas and electricity included. How about that? You can't beat that. <laughs> well, the other thing is you gotta watch out for bullets and shit like that. You know, I mean, you know, like kind of like sometimes you'll be when they they have like shootouts or whatever. You can hear it, you know, boom, 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 from like building to building across, but you kind of like get scared of it. But it might go through the window, hit you while you're sleeping or something like that. So that's the kind of scary part. But other than that, you learn to, when you live in the projects, you learn to live live here. So you pretty much know, much know everybody. Everybody pretty much knows you, you know what I mean? So unless you go into another, somebody else's projects and building, then you don't really know nobody. But other than that, you're not going to be like, scared of the raising. But you're not raising in, in, in the projects, you're going to be kind of scared, you know? You know? But for me, I'm not, I ain't scared. You know, I walk in the project buildings, I'm not, I'm not scared of shit. But this is the way it is. But this is the building I used to live in. Yeah. Man, I used to, we used to run around the hallways all the time. It's not easy. Oh, I used to have fun though when I was a kid. Yeah. Do you mean corridor? Around. What? Corridor? Who? Corridor. What corridor? Hallway. That door is open. Um, don't touch it. I'm going to find it. She's gonna fuck up, she don't even take care of shit, really. Better walls are gonna fuck up, man. They're cheap, I guess, you know, they're just the state of the city or whatever. The money, you know, you know. It's crappy, you know. It looked a little better, though. Know. It looked a little better before. I was like, kind of like shitty. You know. I mean, people were still pissed around the hallways and shit like that. They didn't know it wasn't the best thing, but it was what it was, but. But it's like, kind of like, they don't care about it. Say hi, Jakey. Thank you.